a pretty good board culture with the amount of boards that you see on racks and then everybody just kind of flying around North Guad. There's a whole bunch of different avenues though. I mean, people snowboard, people surf. I surf personally and um, we, during weekends, there are oftentimes groups that go off campus because we have clubs that um, are able to get vehicles and, and people kind of carpool together over to the coast. Being in Southern California, uh, most people don't think that's a possibility, but surprisingly we have a few mountains in the area. My favorite one is Bear, which is about 45 minutes to an hour without traffic. But as long as you have a means to get there, it's possible to go every day. So if you don't have a car, the ski or snowboard club is a great way to meet people who can get you to the mountain. Most of my friends I've met like skiing or wakeboarding or surfing or climbing or any of these outdoor sports and there's such a big community across the five seas. You can just wake up and go skiing. It's possible. I've woken up in the morning a little early than I normally would, drove 45 minutes to go skiing and got back in time for class. I skate around campus because I don't like walking. <laughs> uh, the worst place to fall is right outside of Collins because everybody can see you. Skating to my 8 a.m. class is my favorite trick. So CMC and all the five C's are a part of a ge geological formation called an alluvial fan, which basically just means that the entire region south of the mountain range is just a gentle, gentle slope. So it's perfect for skating. Time to get the great white today though. You can cut the last part out. Chiba! Yeah. Yeah.